They're letting Woosh pick up the early sort of extra levels here in this lane by hanging around. And yeah, so they're able to get in there, start that one up. First Dragon, of course, went across to King. Teleport coming through for both top laners. Yeah, Flandre getting there first, though, has a lot of Narva here as Beast locks down the Dragon. There's the Emperor's Divide as well as Sky bounced out of this one, which gonna get exhausted, but it's ran out now. We'll see whether the Vayne can get any work done as Assassin. Beautiful Force Pulse over the top. As Liam now might be caught out, forced to use that Flash Sky. Very, very low. Barker over the top. So that's fantastic news for King, and Hook lands in the bottom. Yeah, Death Sentence on the land there as well. Didn't decide to take the lantern and first blood going to Chris. Oh, on Holy Grail. Crystal. Oh, forced to use the flash. That is very unfortunate. Final hours pop. The condemn against the wall though. Dredge line comes through. There's Crystal trying to kite around, but it's not going to be enough. Oh my goodness. The turret and he survives. Wooshin with the heal. Beautifully places MLXG. He's going to get exhausted as there's the pre seeker from Beast. He's going to net him that one. And it's the assist as well, but Ella now finds himself a whole bunch of friends. Oh my goodness, the red buff gonna burn him down. Beast now trying to answer this one. Preseeker over the wall. Barker finds himself in an uncomfortable position. Beast picks up Lamb, but Assassin answers the kill. And Sky may just cancel the teleport. He is going to, but Beast super tanky here. Assassin might be in trouble. Blue buff may not be enough here to give him enough mana back to, for this fully stacked Riftwalk as Beast. Finds him yet again. The last Q picks it up with the Cinderhulk. Actually, it's Flandre trying to get himself the extra rage. As this is ridiculous. Flashes over. Sky picks up the kill. Crystal, he's alive again. And Beast coming back through once more. The Arcane smash. Crystal, will he have the rend? He will. It'll be three auto attacks and a rend. And he picks himself up that one. Now Marshall, he poises his way over the hill. Speaker as well. Fair bit of poke actually available for this stake lineup at Beast. Gets caught by the ultimate, but oh. MLSG doesn't find much, but Barker gets dredge lined as Sky makes his way in. There's a Force Pulse onto no one in particular. Crystal gonna take down Sky though. Snake trying to make this fight happen as Meganar's here as well. Completely out of control. They were just able to explode Sky. Really got to, if you get a catch, commit to it. Use everything. Yeah. Get in there and try and make the team fight your own. And oh, wow, able to get some work done down there. Yeah, and there's the teleport coming through as well. There's the Chilling Smite, breaks him out as he comes through trying to twist it advance onto Beast. Flandre looking for this one at the same time as the rest of Snake are going to disengage. The Flash to come through. There's the Flash on Burrow though. They're trying to get Flandre into this one who's turned back to Mini now. Probably better for the chase and Beast, they pick up the kill. I like the mix up here. Yeah, and there's the flash from MLXG. Does manage to get Beast back into the team, but it's probably not the target they want. Crystal going to use the heal there as the depth charge comes through, but doesn't lock him down for too long. Beast, he's going to fall as Woosh coming through there, but Lamb's going to fall down as well because Barker, beautiful use of the ultimate. There's the flash into the death sentence on this guy. The heal from Woosh as they try and turn this one around. Snake, their health bar's getting very, very low, but Woosh and he gets exhausted and they turn it around. Crystal, very, very low. MLXG gets caught. As Assassin comes in the back line and assassinates Crystal, Sun Turret is going to fall down there in the mid lane. He is there now closing the net. Everyone's so low that they don't want to commit to this kill. They'll probably leave it for Beast. Yeah, well, oh my goodness. That death sentence was beautiful from Ella. But he scouted them out. So we'll have to, have to see if that is the case. It's not. No, it's not going to happen. They're going to start it up. Yeah, and Flandre just... Trying to be bodyguard here. He's gonna discover Lamb as the Megan. Yeah. in there. Yeah, Meganar's coming through here as well as he's just gonna take the lantern out as well. And that's gonna be the Ren to secure it. King now you going to engage after that comes through as Barker creates a lot of distance after that death charge comes through. Beast gonna get destroyed in this fight, but you can see, look at the Ren damage. That's a beautiful Empress divide. So much damage with these sand soldiers. The Ren comes through. Woosh trying to make a hero but he's going to get speared to death and lay him. Now running for the hills as Assassin. He's got a decent health bar on him. No way he can go in on this team. Right at the same time, it went from looking like a very good fight for King to an absolute disaster. Yeah, and the Baron went down just before it as well, like they prepared earlier. You've got the inhibitors falling and Snake managed to take the objective. They take the team fight and they take down the turrets. Oh, half health now on this turret. Super creep streaming into the mid lane as you can see the seed start doing some work there. And Crystal, that was a whole lot of auto attacks. Four man that was huge from Beast. The Nah four man as well. Look at the box down and look at this damage coming through from Barker doing so much work.
Beast now trying to zone out MLXG, but this fight is well and truly over. Snake, they're going to take down the inhibitor and they're going to take down the base. It looked, it took a whole lot longer than we were expecting after game one, but Snake, they take the five game series after the final one. 14,000 gold the lead. And man, now, this was not what I was expecting out of this series. And full credit goes to King. It was a beautiful attempt at um, victory after those two wins. But man, Snake, they looked too strong in that last one. Yeah.